Hey, what's up everybody? So, I was driving on the way back from visiting uh, Forgotten Dailies, and I saw this car on the side of the road, but behind me, this really caught my eye. And I wanted to show you guys the car. It uh, belongs to Beast Mode Unicorn Motorsports on Instagram. And guy's name's Carl, pretty cool dude. Uh, this was a show car, actually, from New York, and he picked it up from his uh, old boss, from what he told me, and uh, he's been taking some car shows around the Ohio area, and I uh, wanted to give the guys a really cool little walk around with this thing. So Carl calls this car Icy Hot, and pretty good name for it, you know, with the flames and the ice kind of colors. I really like the old school blue tint on there. This was built right around the Fast and the Furious times, uh, early 2000s. I guess there's actually a parts car for this that looks almost identical, still out in New York area, uh, by the original builder of this car. Um, he worked at a uh, audio and sound place and did all the work himself on it. And Carl painted the wheels white and added the colored center cap to match the flames on the car and the uh, Koenig wheels. She's got a little dent in her from being in a garage years ago, but all in all, it's survived pretty well, you know, for being built almost 20 years ago. Body's actually really, really clean for being a rust belt car. Kind of got to love the old, the old Japanese Little charms hanging down here in the back. Some pretty sweet Escort OEM style mud flaps on the car. Kind of give you guys a cool little walk around of it. Pop the hood open here. See what's underneath the bonnet. It's been lowered two inches. So it's been lowered about two inches from what I've been told from Carl. It's got a nice, you know, strut brace in here, cold air intake. And I really love this polished valve cover. I've only seen a couple people polish these things from the uh, bare aluminum look, and it's definitely kind of a cool thing to do. Got the nice custom oil cap to match the car. Some more ZX tuner parts on here. Got the aftermarket horns and whatnot on it. Good old four cylinder. It's what the 2.3 liter, right? Or the uh, 1.8 liter motor actually in this car. Yeah, so this is the uh, the GT model. Got the Miata style engine in it. As you hear Carl saying there in the background. Got a nice blaster coil on there. Like it's got a sound system in it as well. Fortunately, the battery's dead today. It's got a parasitic draw, you know, like a lot of these custom cars did back in the time, back in the day. It's got the stock interior. Love that little red trim line down there, especially on these seats. I actually had a set of seats for a custom van that looked almost like this. Got the nice pedal covers and the really, really clean looking five digit display dashboard in here so don't believe that's actually 42,000 original miles maybe 142 but it's pretty cool I love that get your little mm -hmm. hood pro or, uh, prop to keep that up oh yeah there's where the power wire went oh yeah, and you got a fifth wheel that matches it that's pretty awesome. And the boom booms aren't quite up though. <laughs> and it's got TVs in the or TV in the headrest. There's a second wire in that headrest for the TV as well. So that one was completely broken. Fortunately that screen was broken, Carl said when he got the car, so not currently hooked up, but eh. pretty sweet car. Hopefully one of these times I can get down here and see it at a car show with everything else and you know, get some more cars in it, so. So, this is Carl from Beast Mode Unicorn Motors on uh, Instagram, so go ahead and check him out. 
Check out Icy Hot on this uh, page. He's also got another car in the back, Beast Mode, the uh, Buick. We actually saw him on the rally last year. Didn't realize he had both these cars, actually. So it's kind of cool putting them all together. We uh, drove the not-so-lifted Prius down with the Active Aero uh, drainage stuff on the front. It worked. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Give Carl a, a like on Instagram, follow him, and uh, the progress in Icy Hot.